the one thing I liked about this course is, is the localization of the context. You see there was the choice of doing the course uh, in an online format. Uh, and I know in an online format, most of the examples that could be used to our case studies could not be immediately relevant to the Kenyan context. Uh, the value addition or the value add by conducting this course through KCIC is that most of the case studies that we use are local companies, companies we know, companies we interact with uh, directly day to, in our day-to-day -day activities. Uh, so through the learnings, uh, I'm already in a position to advise most of the companies on how to do the sustainability reports in a manner that uh, presents them in the, in the, in the best uh, way possible. I think first of all there was the range and the depth of content, there was the practical delivery through the group work and the assignments, there was the overall management of the course, it was very professionally run, um, there were networking opportunities, I got to meet amazing um, other practitioners, specialists in their fields across Africa from Uganda, Nigeria, so that was very, very, it was, it was really worth it for me. I'm privileged that in the environment where I work in, we interact with the manufacturers. And uh, oftentimes manufacturers have been castigated for most of the environmental uh, problems in Kenya. Uh, sometimes it is rightfully so, but most of the time it's also because they do not present uh, their efforts in protecting the environment in a very good way uh, through the reports they generate. We increasingly uh, urging companies, uh, manufacturers or otherwise, to move towards uh, this kind of sustainability reporting. And I think GRI is, um, because of the, the way it presents the information in a global context, it means the reports can be digested in, in, in any place in this, in this world. Uh, and therefore, they can even be used such reports even to attract more investment, even attract uh, the kind of employees. You know, nowadays even employees are even concerned about the impacts of the companies they are joining. So, so yes, uh, I think it is, it is going forward, it's going to be very useful for me in, in my work as a sustainability expert. Many times, well, I think there's a sort of understanding that when you're reporting on the performance of an organization, you only need to talk about the good things, the positive impacts. But sustainability reporting allows you to actually speak about both the positive and the negative impacts. And not just stop there, but equips you with the tool to develop an action plan on how you're going to address them, the negative impacts. So you don't just hide the things that are not working out well, but you can be open and honest and talk about them. And I think that's very good for businesses or organizations in enhancing their reputation. Yeah.